And some of those ukuleles at Kapilani Park today were made by a longtime Hawaii business. KITB 4's Paul Drews takes a tour of the Kamaka ukulele factory. Every day, employees of the Kamaka factory shape, sand, and meticulously craft more than a dozen ukuleles. Our instruments are made to last generations uh, because they're passed down from you know, the original purchaser and they pass it down to their son or daughter and it gets passed down to the grandson, granddaughter. And so we have to make our instruments so that they last a long time. And we wanted to find out how to build guitars. And nobody came to teach us how to build guitars. At 90 years old, Fred Sr. still leads right, tours of the family business, which got its start way back in 1916. Everything made. In Hawaii at the time, my father was, was high pitch, color it, like the violin mandolin sound. But Sam Sr. discovered a way to make the little ukulele sound bigger. One of the reasons we survived was because of my grandfather and the pineapple ukulele, which was sort of the, the thing that made his name in the business. It's a happy instrument. Um, I love the sound. I love um, what I can do with it, you know, sharing a part of me through the ukulele. Musician Chris Kamaka uses his talents to make sure each ukulele sounds just right before it leaves the factory. My dad and my grandpa always told, told us that the bottom line is the sound of the instrument. Chris is just one of the many workers who has a hand in the construction of the ukuleles, which not only takes two dozen employees, but also four years. Blocks of koa wood have to be aged properly, or they're cut into the many pieces that make up the various instruments. A smaller size soprano model, which includes the signature pineapple ukulele, to three larger versions, six and eight string versions, as well as custom creations. In honor of the pineapple ukulele's important part of Kamaka's past, something special is being planned for the company's 100th anniversary next year. And then we're also looking at making a special anniversary limited edition model. And it looks like it will be a pineapple ukulele. At the Kamaka factory, Paul Drews, KITV4 News.